kwanza mheshimiwa Malala uh, nataka a stop uh, to poke nose where he is not supposed to be and he must take this from me ya kwamba yeye anaindafia kila mahali including even in the management of UDA itself na anaenda kuharibu uhusiano kati ya UDA na vyama tanzu ambazo uh, ni vyama ambazo uh, ni vya muungano muungano wa, wa Kenya kwanza and so mheshimiwa Mal- Malala must stop secondly Malala must understand that he is where he is kwa sababu ya zile vyama ambazo anaita village parties he came from ANC uh, where he was a senator and where he was an MC before and therefore if it is a village party then he should not have stood on, a, on on ANC malala yuko pali yuko kwa sababu ya chama cha ANC na kwa hivyo he cannot call his own, own home a village party uh, every political party has its own strength kila UDA ina political strength back uh, backyard yake Ford Kenya ina backyard yake na sisi backyard our strength belongs in Bungoma our strength belongs in Transoe and we must strengthen those regions in order to bargain with others our strength is also in Kakamega and therefore Malala should stop calling uh, other people other uh, parties as village parties and and so he should also have the courtesy the respect and he should also have uh, uh, some some amount of decency in himself kwa sababu kienda chama ambaye yuko control na na Moses Wetangula ambaye pia ni speaker of the national assembly chama ambaye ina MCS hata kule Nandi hata kule Kwale and then you start calling it uh, a village party that is not respect at all And if Malala does not want to respect us we shall not respect him and we shall treat him the way he wants if he doesn't do, if he wants to know that we are a village party and he wants to know that we can also react let him step in Bungoma and say that right in Bungoma and he will see that we are not a village party because we shall deal with him in the way that he wants i told malala before that we are not going to fold our parties and i told him when we were having a meeting with him that we are not going to fold and ford kenya will never fold it is a party that will ha- shall hand over to the future generations we can only strengthen we can only bring in more people and more stakeholders to strengthen uh, our party but we cannot be able to fold and therefore malala thinking that we can be able to fold K- ford kenya that is they dreaming and we are not going to do it we are not going to fold ford kenya and so you should forget about it and he should not even talk about it Dad, akitaka aende counseling wa mcounsel ili akubali ya kwamba tutaendelea aende lakini hatuendi kuvunja hiyo chama namba 2 anaingilia kila mahali hata nimeona watu wa UDA wenyewe kule Kiambu na complain yeye aache kiburi aache hiyo kiburi akitaka tusikizane aache kiburi kabisa awe na heshima awe na courtesy na awe na respect anajua vizuri ya kwamba chama cha Ford Kenya mkubwa wao ni pia speaker ambaye ni Moses Masika Wetangula chama cha ANC mkubwa wao ni Msalia Mdavadi ambaye pia ni cabinet eh, prime cabinet secretary na vile anaingilia hivi vyama yeye anakosa heshima kwa wakubwa wetu this is lagran from simple generations